So I'll hear people say, if you believe it, then you can achieve it. And the problem with that is they're leaving out the most important part of the equation. And that part is work, action, actually doing something. That's what you have to do to achieve anything. Yeah, you gotta believe it, but you better get the work done. And most people will not be successful. They will not reach whatever they wrote because when there's not anything emotionally attached to it, they're gonna quit and give up. Most people were closer than they ever thought they were to finishing that big thing, but they never finished it because they didn't feel like finishing it. Or they were doing it and it was pain. And most people quit in the pain because the pain hurts so bad that they don't know if they want to keep going to get to go. Because you're going to wake up most days and not feel like it. You're going to wake up most days and not be pumped up. You're going to wake up most days and not feel like doing it. But when you can get to a point that you do it anyway, then there's no way you won't reach any of your goals. There's things that you know you're supposed to do as a human being. Things that you know are going to improve your life. Do those things. There's things that you know are going to make you a worse person and make your life worse. Don't do those things. Get up early. Do some kind of workout. Eat good foods. Clean your room. Make a list of things that you're supposed to do in your life. And then wake up in the morning and do those things. And no, it is not easy. But you're not going to get it from anyone else but you. You think things are going to just go your way? Well, they're not going to just go your way. You gotta make them go your way. You think things are gonna just happen for you? Well, they're not just gonna happen for you. You gotta make them happen. Everyone seems to think that this world, this government, somebody owes them something. Nobody owes you shit. If you want something, go out there and get it. Go out there and fucking take it. That's all there is to it. You need to stop this whining, this crying all the damn time, and get up and do something about it. And the biggest thing I see getting in the way is your fucking feelings. F*** your feelings. Where there's a will, there's a way. When you've got air in your lungs, then you have no excuse. It's just a matter of perspective. You're either going to be a fucking sheep, or you're going to be a lion. You're going to be an attacker and a go-getter. But if you want to sit there and cry, bitch, and moan and whine all the fucking time, what you can't, 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 then you sit your ass on that bench with the losers, and you stay there. But don't expect me to turn around and pat you on the back and say, hey, good job for being a fucking quitter. Get up and do something about it. People who win can do sh and people who lose talk sh You can win if you choose to learn the things that you need to do and then can do them. That's reality. That's the sh nobody wants to admit because admitting so means that you have to take responsibility for where you are currently. And you have to say, I am where I am currently because I didn't do X, Y, and Z. And guess what? That can hurts a little bit. But once you accept that truth, you are able to then move forward with the actions required to get you to where you want to go. Discipline your body. Free your mind. Get up early and go. Get after it and you will become the person you want to be. And you become that person through one small decision at a time.